welcome to a new video. I hope everybody is doing well. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Steffi and I am a lifestyle vlogger, vlogging all things life, such as hauls like this one, <laughs> uh, weekend vlogs occasionally, travel vlogs, reviews, etc. Um, yeah, just general life, basically. And for those of you that do know me, welcome back. <laughs> Today's video is a George or Asda George, George Asda haul. <laughs> um, it started off as an online order and then it turned into returning some stuff from that online order, going to Asda and buying from the store. <laughs> um, originally I bought some clothes and they did not work out well for me so I have basically returned them. I bought a jacket, uh, some jumpers and a pair of boots and as nice as they were they weren't really me but I did manage to keep one jumper which I really really like and it's really really warm so that is what I'm going to show you first. So it is this lovely stripy blue light blue dark blue almost icy white blue um, jumper and it is very very fluffy and very very warm. I was wearing it last night and I was just sort of standing next. I was trying it on and I was like, oh, this is really warm. So I am very, very excited to wear this. I will insert a picture of me wearing it so you can see what it looks like because obviously it's a bit hard to show on camera. But yeah, I love this jumper. It's so, so nice, so cozy, perfect for winter. And this was originally £16 and it was on sale for £12.80 so I was very happy I got it on sale and it's also um, George For Good uh, from that collection which is basically, this is made out of recycled materials so yeah, good for the environment <laughs> I do love this I'm not going to do it in order of online order, shop order I'll tell you where I got it from um, but the majority theme <laughs> of these purchases is Christmas. So I'm gonna do all the Christmas stuff last because there's only a few that are non-Christmassy. So that was one, which was the jumper. Although blue, you know, kind of goes with the Christmassy colors. <laughs> but uh, I have something Halloween-y and it is this Harry Potter mug. And I completely forgot all about this until I saw it on the shelf and I was like, oh yeah. And then I saw the Harry Potter and I was like, oh yeah, it's a Harry Potter mug. And then, yep, they had one S left and this is so cute it's really cute although i wish they had the letter on both sides because i mean i don't know about you but I, i'm guessing the majority of people hold it in their right hand at least i do when i drink my drink so i mean it's nice that i can see the s but i don't know i feel like the main designy bit should be on the back I guess but anyway I digress um, but it's so cute I think it's mainly for Halloween and it's got the snitch got the cauldron oh, sorry about the glare we've got Harry's glasses broomsticks they floating candles stars obviously Hedwig and we've got the sorting hat Hogwarts letters and yeah, and then you've got Harry Potter on the inside there. It's just white in the middle and then it's got little legs. So it's basically like a cauldron. And yeah, I love it. <laughs> it's so cute. Shouldn't have got it, but I am a sucker for mugs. So <laughs> it was £4.75 and this was from the store, not online. Next purchase from the store. Uh, Again, I'd seen all of this on people's Instagrams and TikToks and I was like, oh, I want it, I want it, but do I want it? And then, well, it just ended up in the trolley. <laughs> it's the Stitch Tumbler. So you've got Stitch's face here, his ears, and then it's all glittery. Now, the downside to this is that there was no straw with it. I'm assuming the straw was blue think it was so yeah I have no straw <laughs> but I can use a straw from one of my other cups that I have like this but I'm gonna go online 
and I'm going to buy some glittery ones that I hope will go with this because yeah I feel like if the, the straw that came with this was glittery maybe I don't know we'll have to look it up um, but that's the inside nothing fancy you can just see the design really and then the lid but it's a good size um, like maybe larger than a large McDonald's cup maybe yeah it's very cute and I think this is seven pounds which is pricey but it's actually not too bad considering Disney store ones are about 11 pound 12 pounds so yeah on to the Christmas stuff <laughs> so this was an online purchase and it is it's the Santa Claus it is a Santa Claus wax melt burner so get candles in here then you've got your wax melt up here and I don't actually have a Christmas one um, I have a Halloween one which I got from Etsy and it's basically a pumpkin jack-o-lantern um, and yeah I never managed to get one for Christmas last year because the Halloween one I got last year so when I saw this I was like yep I definitely want to get this because I do love my wax melts but yeah he's so cute and I love his scarf as well it's very different to what you think Santa would wear you know orange black and white or black stripes yeah very cute and this was five pounds next up is from the online order I'm denied about these <laughs> and then ultimately in the end David kind of made the decision for me uh, David is my husband for those of you who don't know or Dave um, and you'll see why later on I'll explain <laughs> but uh, he liked these over something else that I liked and sort of as a compromise but again we'll get into that story later but <laughs> we have a stitch bowl with Merry Stitchmas on it. Oh, let's see. Yeah, so it says Merry Stitchmas. Got Stitch in his winter Christmas wear. And it's just bright red with tropical leaves behind it. And yeah, it's really cute. It's quite small. Um, it's not really a dessert bowl size, I'd say. I'd say it's kiddie size. But we can put things like nibbles in this and you know we've got people around just chuck stuff in it and people can pick from it um, but it was a set so it also came with a matching mug which again is smaller than the kind of mug I go for but that is fine because it's perfect for hot chocolate <laughs> so it's the same design Merry Stitchmas with Stitch in his Christmas winter gear and yeah not much just Disney on the bottom so this is a set so you get two bowls and two two mugs and I cannot remember the price but I'll put it up on the screen for you but yeah went for these right next up keeping with the uh, stitch Christmas theme again did I need to buy this no but I did <laughs> and it's this really cute cushion which again says Merry Stitchmas and he's eating a cookie and it's just so cute and really squishy and yeah I don't have any Christmas cushions so um that's my excuse I don't have a Christmas cushion <laughs> um, but yeah he's so cute and I think he looks the cutest in his little Christmas outfit I've never met him in a Christmas outfit at the parks before, but I've seen him in one of the shows at Disneyland Paris, and he's still pretty cute. Uh, and this was eight pounds, I think. If I'm wrong, I'll put the price up on the screen, but yeah. <laughs> of course, when you've got the cushion, you kind of need the bedding to go with it. Um, oh, that stitch cushion was from an online order, so this next purchase was from the store because this was out of stock online and uh, <laughs> it is the matching duvet now normally I wouldn't really go for the 
full on Disney design but it's Stitch and as everybody knows Stitch is my favourite, I love him and yeah it's just so cute so it's the same design and it's reversible so you've got Stitch eating his cookie and then two big giant Stitch faces as your pillowcase and then the reversible design is uh, it's basically candy cane and cookies and hearts and things like that so it's quite pretty um, but yeah <laughs> should I have bought it? no but I did <laughs> and this is king size so this was 25 which isn't bad considering for a king size so yeah I'll probably put this on the bed in November because I don't decorate for Christmas until December, like the first weekend in December, because I can't have the Christmas decorations up for too long, otherwise I'll just get sick of them. Not to mention my tree is mahoosive, so <laughs> it gets in the way. But we can sort of celebrate Christmas a bit early and yeah, put this up or put this on the bed in November. Give it a wash because it's a bit rough feeling. Um, it is it's almost 50-50, 52% polyester, 48% cotton, but it's not too bad. The last Stitch Christmas themed purchases, which again, uh, did I need to buy it? No, but I did. <laughs> and it is, oh, this is heavy. Oh, it's a dinnerware set. Oh. So there's a story behind this in that Originally, I was just going to buy this dinnerware set, and then I wasn't, because I was like, do I need to buy a Christmas dinnerware set? And then, <laughs> I was online, going to purchase this, but then I thought, uh, you've got the set with the bowls, and it's red, and it's really pretty, um, but do I need both? And I was like, this Christmas set, as cute as it is, I don't know is this the design I want? And then I saw a polar bear design and it had, it was basically grey and white plates and it had polar bears on the bottom in a snowy scene and then on the top of the plate it had Santa flying across the sky and his reindeer going in like an arc. Um, so I thought, do you know what, I'll get the red bowls because they're cute and this is more Christmassy and we could probably <laughs> use these plates when we have company around at Christmas time and not get teased <laughs> by family um, so we'll, I'll get the polar bear one and I made a boo-boo because <laughs> I was talking to my friend Sarah like talking on a uh, chat and then I was waiting for David to email me back and then I really wanted to place this order so it was just getting very frazzled, or I was getting very frazzled, and I ended up buying just the plates of the polar bear set. So the idea was to basically go back to Asda, take these back and swap it out for the actual dinner set. And then we get to Asda, and um, yeah, we see both sets literally side by side. So we picked them up because they were on the bottom shelf, picked them up and put them at level with us. And I was like, this is the one I wanted to get. And then David said, oh, but I didn't want that set. I was like, but you didn't tell me that. <laughs> you know, I was literally waiting for you to email me, blah, blah, blah. So I was saying to him, well, which one should we get? And then I was saying about the whole, the polar bear would work better with family, so we won't get teased, blah, blah, blah. I know it doesn't matter, but you know, sometimes these things happen. And, um, you know, we were going back and forth and we were going to get the polar bears, but then I kept, just, my eye just kept being drawn to Stitch. And I thought, do you know what, sod it, it's Stitch. When do you get much Stitch stuff and Christmassy stuff? So, yeah, here we are. Oh, it is a 12 piece set. It is very heavy and it's dishwasher safe and microwave safe. <laughs> um, but it is. It's a, basically it's white background with Merry Stitchmas, same as the bowl except it's white instead of red. Although I think, I don't know, there could be a red rim on the plate maybe. Yeah, I think there is. Um, but it's ugh, four plates, like dinner plates. Then you've got four side plates and then you've got four bowls. Ugh. And I think these bowls are bigger. 
than the other ones. But yeah. It was pricey at £35, but I don't care. I've been feeling down lately, so this cheered me up when I saw it because I literally squealed when I saw that and the duvet set, so yeah. <laughs> <sighs> and this was from store, just to reiterate. Okay, we're almost at the end. Last two purchases, I think. Um, so first up we have this bowl plastic bowl large good for just chucking snacky snacks in and it's just a candy cane design um, and it was only 150 so I thought this would be good because we're always buying snacks and we can just put it in here and it'll be all nice and neat and put together and look pretty on the table so yeah the last purchase came from in store and this was more David than me because yeah I just caved behind his reasoning and stuff which was it's the last one on the shelf and I'm you know when when do you stand here with uh, a giant Mickey head cookie jar <laughs> for Christmas honestly half this stuff but it makes me happy so. <laughs> but yeah it is a giant Mickey head cookie jar and it actually is really cool when you look at it online it doesn't look all that but on the shelf it's is very cool and it's just it's well made actually it looks really good um, and yeah just a basic cookie jar it's all tied together at the moment I'm not gonna cut it off but we all know what cookie jar is you take the head off put the cookies in and have your cookies <laughs> um, but yeah this was the last purchase and it was £15, a bit pricey, but uh, we can all blame David for that one. <laughs> but yeah, that is everything for this George Astor haul. What do you guys like? What's your favourite thing out of the entire thing? Do you have any of this stuff? Um, let me know in the comments below. Let's get conversation going yeah that is it i hope you enjoyed it if you did please do give it a like subscribe if you haven't already and i'll see you in the next one bye